What's up, everybody? This your boy, A-Dog, and once again, we are back with another movie reaction, and this one right here is called Gran Torino. And this one right here was um, highly, highly requested. Y'all really wanted me to check this one right here out. Now, uh, we gotta say a disclaimer before the video to let everybody know that I cannot play the entire video, so it will be parts that's uh, missing due to the fact that I cannot upload the entire video to YouTube or I will get a copyright strike. I heard some people in my last video saying, yes, you can, bro. No, you cannot. I've been doing this for a while. And trust me, I know what you can do and what you can't do. So like I said, if you want to uh, see the full movie reaction to this movie right here and my full reaction, no edits, no cutouts or nothing, make sure to follow us on Patreon. I will have it in the pin, the top pin comment section. Like I said before, I cannot post the entire video because, like I said, I do not uh, own the rights to this movie. So I could just, and that's like I said, one of the reasons why I cannot post my entire reaction on YouTube due to that fact. But I can post it on uh, Patreon. So that's why I said make sure you follow us on Patreon. That way you can watch all of our movie uh, reactions. The whole four, two, three hour movie, you can watch the whole thing with me on Patreon. All right. Without further ado, not gonna hold y'all up. Let's go ahead and dive straight into this, y'all. Let's go. A Time Warner Company. I'm ready for this one now. Y'all said this one right here was pretty good, cause that's what I was hearing now. Y'all was like, eight hours, you gotta watch Gran Torino. It is really, really good. So that's why I'm saying, hey, let's check it out. Let's see how it is. Let's see what all the hype was about. Gran Torino. Oh, like they're having a funeral service. What the world? <laughs> it's just funny, like how he just sitting up there looking at them, boy. He just looking at them like in I'm pissed off type of way. Why don't you have him move in with you? <laughs> he looking like, no, nah, that ain't gonna happen now. That ain't gonna happen now. And that's why you have to turn to the Lord. Jesus. Because the Lord is the sweetness. Yeah, they up in there playing on the phone and everything. Like, you're not supposed to be doing that. You do not supposed to be doing it at a time like that. <sighs> boy, they sat back down real quick, boy. He, he didn't even get down there in time to even catch him. This for chairs? No. You probably just painted your nails. <coughs> yeah, he said you probably just painted your nails. Swamp rats can get in one room. <laughs> She's smoking a cigarette? Grandpa, when'd you get the uh, vintage car? 1972. Oh, he stumped it out. How old is she? Is she even old enough to smoke a cigarette? Die. Dang. What kind of question is that? What is you going to do with it when you die? That was, what kind of, that was crazy. I appreciate the kindness you've shown to my wife. Now that you've spoken your piece, why don't you go tend to some of your other sheep? Golly. And I confess that I have no desire to confess to a boy that's just out of the seminary. Golly. I don't want to hear none of that. I'll call you in a few and see how you're doing. Michigan tag. Music, good. Let's see what we're finna do. Damn barbarians. Golly. Now they still bringing place up in there. Like he, he was the one stuck in there washing dishes, boy. Man, they were constantly bringing plates on up in there, though. Is 
Cause all you supposed to do is sweep them steps off, have that yard mode, have it looking good. What the hell did Jinx have to move into this neighborhood for? Uh, it seems like he don't like them people that's next door. Whoa, what the world? Are you gone completely deaf or something? Walt? Look, I'm not a friend of yours. Why do you insist on calling me Walt? <laughs> who likes to hold the hands of old ladies who are superstitious and promises them eternity? Whoa, he should never ask them. You should never ask them. And he gave you an answer. But I see what he's doing though. He's just trying to check on him, see how he's doing and stuff, man. You know, after the morning and stuff. Fucking slugs, man. Everywhere you look, man. Fucking slugs Fuck everywhere you go, man. man. He's just laughing at him, just letting him talk. Yeah, man. Oh, they still messing with him, too. Fly solo, man. Fly solo? Man, let's go down and see what the fuck they doing over there. Uh-oh, hey, good hey, folks. Yeah, because they show over there just messing with him. They show over there messing with him. Oh, he got that gun out. Uh-huh. Yeah, they seen it. The boy pulled out that Beretta. He pulled out that Beretta. Come on, man. We just bailed your ass out, dog. Come on. He finna, he finna put him in that car. I got your little girl. Come on, bro. Come on, man. Let's go, man. We got the gun, man. Come on. Fuck you, man. Get the fuck out of here. They sure just saved him. He should have got his butt in that car. Fuck that. Pussy. Lee should have got in there. I'm here, right? Hey, Spider, who that? What's up? Spider? Is that what he just called you, Fong? <laughs> what are you doing here? Hey, so how old are you anyway? Mentally, I'm way too old for you. What? <laughs> hey, you gonna roll with us, man? Come on. Dude. They don't need to ride with them. We're cuz, right? Come on. We're cuz, right? We're family. Man, they started trying to get him to go and he don't want to go. I don't blame him. I wouldn't want to get in the car with him either, though. Call me God. Come on. I don't trust them, boy. Ain't no way I would want to win with them. I would have ran in the house. Yo, now that's a nice car. Hell yeah. They finna try to steal it? Oh uh, no, they messing with the wrong person now. <laughs> so, here's where my flock congregates when they're not in church. Hey, Father Jay. Hi, man. <laughs> hey, he looking like, oh, not him again. <laughs> he said he was going to check on him, though. He said he was going to check on him every chance he got. Darn you. Promised your wife. All right, let's get a booth. But that's the thing, though. He, he did promise his wife that, you know, he was going to check on him, make sure he's all right and stuff like that. And that's what he's doing. So you can't blame him for that. Sounds like you know a lot more about death than you do living. <laughs> so, like you know a lot about uh, more about death than you do living. Maybe so, Father. Oh. Maybe so. Oh, he heard that. They trying to steal his car. Sound like it. Son of a bitch. Yeah, they trying to steal his car. He heard that. He better get that. He better get that gun. He heard that. Oh, man. He hurt himself now. Hey, man. Get in the car. car. Tal, what the fuck? Get in. Get in, Tal. Come on, let's go, man. Get in. Fuck, man. See that? See that? See, they gonna get him in trouble. See, he done hurt himself and everything. That man done hurt himself and everything, man. They up there sitting that little boy in there to try to steal a, steal that man's car. See, that's why I said you can't hang around folks like that, man. Be trying to be trying to uh, put you up to steal and do stuff bad. I don't hang around people like that. Yeah, no. Hey, smooth sailing. Yeah. I don't know if he gonna tell them about what happened last night. Lions season tickets? Golly. 
<laughs> he just hung up on him. You know what? If I were him, well, if I were him, I'd take the battery out that sun gun and everything. I promise you I'd take that battery out. That she's sweet. You ain't going nowhere without that battery. Is he gonna put it back? Is he gonna put it back in the garage? Come on. Damn, so he gonna leave the car right there knowing that they just tried to steal it last night. So now he gonna leave it out for us. It's more easy for him to get it. There they go again. I told what? you guys already. Can I just come hang out with my little cousin? Huh? Yeah, you trying to hang out with him just so you can uh try to get him to steal something. <laughs> Golly, they're out there trying to make him go. They trying to make him go, bro. That's crazy. This is crazy, man. You can count on that. We used to stack fucks like you five feet high in Korea. Use you for sale. Woo. Woo he ain't playing. You better go. It's crazy. He ain't playing, boy. Hey, he ain't playing. Walt ain't playing around. I feel like he gonna end up having to do something to them because they gonna keep trying him and they gonna try to take his car. All they trying to do is come get him. They trying to use that little boy to steal and all that stuff so he can get caught and they get away. What the word? What the hell is this? What the word? How they put all on it? No, 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 no. Come on, no more. No more, no more. What? They, what the word? They go, they're like, they started bringing stuff, putting it on the porch. Why are you bringing me all this garbage anyway? Because, because you saved how? Oh. Oh, no, I just want to be left alone. Thank you. Wait. Oh, that's why. Cause they said they feel they feel like that he saved saved him. You're done. Yeah, because like I said, they that's, they them uh, guys, his cousins, they were trying to use him to steal that car. He didn't want to do it. They they made him do it. Uh-oh, here he come again. Good afternoon, Walt. Hey, he coming every day to check on Walt, boy. <laughs> One thing you can say, he's consistent. You know, I, I prayed that they would show up, but nobody answered. <laughs> he said, I prayed, but no one showed up. Oh, man. Killing to save yourself, killing to save others. Hmm. You're right. Those are things I know nothing about. He taking matters to his own hand. He feel like if somebody come on his lung, he got the right to shoot him. So he ain't playing around. Walt ain't playing around. The thing that haunts a man the most is what he isn't ordered to do. Hmm. Finally look like a human being again. You shouldn't wait so long between haircuts, you cheap son of a bitch. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you know how it is. We were trying to save on to that money, though, but you do need to go to the barbershop, get that line up, man. You feel feel more better. You feel fresh. Feel relieved. Raising the prices all the time. It's been 10 bucks for the last five years, you hard-nosed Polak son of a bitch. <laughs> Bring that little tight ass over here. Come here, girl. Let me shot. Damn, man, you can't say hi? Why are you acting all stuck up? Man. What you supposed to be, man? Yeah, it's cool, dog. What the world? What the fuck you doing in my neighborhood, boy? Nothing. Let's go down a corner spot, you know, get some CDs. See, you gotta, you gotta hold up, bro. You can't act like that in front of folks. Now they think he's soft. Yeah, fuck out of here, man. Oh man. Yeah, okay. It's take a crude, overly obvious comment to every woman who walks past and cram it. That's my. I hope Walt come out and get them for. Stay right there, Walt, in case they try some. So you. Bitch is crazy. I like him like that. Let's take this bitch. 
Boy, I tell you the truth. Get your ass over there. Uh oh. <laughs> you better get your ass on, Hunky, while I still let you. That's right, That's what you better do. Uh oh. Come on, Waltz. Uh oh. Come on, Waltz. Notice how you come across somebody once in a while that you shouldn't have fucked with. Uh oh. Finger at me. Oh, shit. Come on now. Hey, Pops. Come on now. Shut your fucking face. You know what I'm talking about. Or something. These guys don't want to be your bro, and I don't blame them. Now get your old fave patty ass on down the road. Yeah, he ain't no protection or nothing. I don't know why he even would have. Oh, yeah. Hey, boy, I'm telling you, that's the second time he didn't say them. I thought you Asian girls were supposed to be smart. Hang around a neighborhood like that's a fast way to get you in the obituary. Michelle Liu. You mean home? Yeah. I'm home. Not home. Whatever. Yeah, because that's the second time he didn't say them. People. We were hill people, mm. not jungle people. Booga, booga, booga. Yeah. He's right, though, because like I said, that dude she was with, he's no protection at all, bro. He's no protection. He's trying to fit in and all type of stuff, and that was just a sign of weakness that he showed them guys that he was just weak. You don't need to hang with nobody that can't protect you. <sighs> and then she's still looking at him, too. <laughs> she's just over there just staring at him, bro. Golly. And then he already don't want them next door, and then every time he sit on his porch, they, she's just staring at him. How about that? How about that? Shout out to Todd. Yeah, cause Walt was just finna go over there and help her. But you got some kids that's just, man, <laughs> he just don't like her for so. It's got to be a lot to maintain around here, mm -hmm. let alone clean. And um, I don't know, you're here all alone. They're trying to put him in a home or something. This is now, you know, these communities where you don't have to worry about mowing the lawn or shoveling snow. Oh, they trying to get him to leave their house. And that's what it seems like. Like they're trying to put him in a home or something. It's like staying in a hotel practically. They're beautiful. They really are. Yeah. They take care of everything. They, they, they'll clean up. They're really nice. I get what they're trying to do, like take a lot off him. But then, you know, you get some people that they like to stay in their own space. They don't like to be in no home and stuff. Well, he mad. Tom, goddamn kids have more sense than we do. Uh, we miss mama, don't we? I knew it. I knew he didn't like that, though. That man ain't finna leave his house and go stay in no home, no group home and all that. He wasn't finna do that. I knew he wasn't gonna do that. Oh, here she come. Just keep your hands off my dog. No worries. We only eat cats. <laughs> he said, just keep my hand off my dog. He said, we only eat cats. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. He ain't got no more beer. Little beef jerky. Come on over and get something to eat. We got beer too. <laughs> and he probably won't that. Every time I look at somebody, they always look at the ground. Hey, it seemed like all she had to do was say beer, and that's what he's gonna get. <laughs> Man, look how they looking. It may. Hey, dude, we should go into the other room. Sorry. Hey, like when I, they start looking at me like that, I'm getting out. I'm going right back to my house. Of course. It's monk food. Yeah. Okay. Can I come back for seconds? <laughs> Walter, well, he want to come back for seconds. I don't blame you. When they feel good, yeah, we all going to come back for seconds. Ain't no wrong with that. Witch doctor or something? Something like that. Yeah. Well, <laughs> You're funny, Wally. <laughs> He's saying Wally. Yeah. You're thinking. You're thinking now. <laughs> I wonder what's wrong with him. Bit my tongue. Uh, it's, it's nothing. Oh, 
Why don't we go down and get some of that good gook food, you know? <laughs> He's saying good gook food. Oh. We didn't see. Oh, fantastic. You ladies are wonderful. Boy, they feeling hit plate up, oh, boy. They ain't playing. It ain't nothing like uh, going over to uh, the neighbor's house fixing you a plate. What for? Mingle. Mingle. Yeah. Mingle yeah. right here. Dang, they feeling hit plate up. He better take it with him. <laughs> Warm it up for later. Dang, they down there too. <laughs> Like he just sad too. <sighs> I used to hate them washing machines in the dry like that. They be doing all that wobbling when they come on. You gotta tighten up that bottom sometimes. Well, if that wheel broke, you might have to put something under it. Yeah. He, he must like her or something the way you keep looking over there. Hi, Walt. I'm you. Too young. No, you are. Oh, you are. Description for <laughs> fixed up, and then I, I, I even fixed a door <laughs> that hadn't even broken yet. He <laughs> said, I even fixed a door that ain't broken yet. Shout out to Waltz, man. <laughs> it's Tao. What? It's not Toad. It's Tao. My name is Tao. Oh, Tao. I thought it was Todd. He said Tao. Yum, yum. You know, the girl in the purple sweater. She's been looking at you all day, stupid. Sure was. She sure was. You said yum yum. A very charming girl. I talked with her. Yeah. But you, you let her just walk right out with the three stooges. <laughs> you let her walk out with the three stooges. <laughs> They're bringing him some more stuff? Well, they gonna fill his whole porch up. Oh, God. Is this that chicken dumpling thing? Oh, all right. Boy, they gonna be bringing him some every day. He gonna get to the point where he ain't gonna wanna help him no more. Cause he knows as soon as he help him, they gonna bring him a, <laughs> they gonna bring him a load of stuff to the house. What the world? They're sitting on the porch waiting on them. It's very important to my mom that you accept, and it would be an insult if you refuse. Golly. If he doesn't want to do it, then, then let's just go. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Shut up. Oh, God. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> He get, I'm telling you, it, go, it get to the point where he probably ain't even going to help him no more, man. Like, you want to help people, but when they go overboard like that, every time you help them, they just bring them food, flowers, and everything. Which is nice, but he like, man, that's too much. <laughs> See that tree right there? You just go over there and count the birds. Golly. I'm not the one who tried to steal. Don't you forget that. I don't know why he just didn't say that they put him up to it. How long do I have you for? Oh, he like he already in the fountain. So. All right. Go get the ladder out of the garage. Uh-oh. I got I'm tired of looking at it the last three years. Okay, Paul. So he got the guy I'm working on the house. They're putting them to work. Yo, that he where he working though. I don't know if he should have him working in the rain though, but man. The big wasp nest under our porch. Wasp nest. A wasp. <laughs> Damn, he been coughing up blood and stuff. He probably need to go to the doctor. Yeah, okay. I said, now he went to the doctor. I'm about to say, I'm like, yeah, he need to go to the doctor. Koski? Koski? Yeah, Koski. Uh, Dr. Feldman retired three years ago. I'm his replacement. 
Dr. Chu. Dr. Chu. I think like he wanted to tell him something, but then he didn't. But then it seemed like his son is still mad at him and stuff too. Not these cats again. Yeah, that's why I said he gotta watch them, man. That thing like it finna fall. He need to cut that off. I would have cut that song going off, boy. Like that song gonna probably finna fall, boy. Finna come out of there. His salt couldn't do half of the household chores with just those mm. few things. Anything else you need, you just borrow it. That's all. It do take a lot of. It do take a long time, you know, to um to get that much stuff. Nothing, huh? I just saw you cut the blood. That's not good. You should sure. really see a doctor. <clears throat> yeah, that's why I said he kept coughing up blood and stuff. My Gran Torino. Yep, that's what they wanted. Oh, he should. He shouldn't be pulling that thing upstairs. <laughs> He should be trying to pull that up there by itself. I'm here because you need help. So it's either top or I'm out of here. <laughs> hey, you, hey, look, Walt, you did kept calling him a uh, P word now, and now he's he letting you know. Over to okay. You chose that cut him a deal on it. But you're a good man, Wally. I wish our father would have been more like you. Don't go calling me Wally. <laughs> Wally. Again. What's that supposed to mean? Hmm. Things saved him from that fucked cousin of ours. Hey, watch your language, lady. And <laughs> That's bad for you. Yeah. So is being in a gang, dipshit. <laughs> yeah. I put the steering column in this uh, Grand Torino in 1972. That's not going to be clean, though. Well, maybe you should get a job. You can't just sit there and spread mulch in my garden the rest. <laughs> construction? Yeah. Do you have Alzheimer's or something? No. You can get a job in construction. I know. Yeah, construction pretty good, but man, it'd be hot, boy. Woo! It'd be hot, man. I would like, forget construction. I'm not doing it. <laughs> I mean, I would if I have to, but man, construction is something else, boy. There's some good money in it, though. I, say, I can say that there's some good money in it. You okay? You ready? Sir. All right. Let's go ahead. Look what he looking at. You see, kid? Now that's how guys talk to one another. They do? When you got shit in your ears? Hmm. What's up, you old Italian prick? <laughs> and those sons of bitches really nailed me. I mean, they screwed me right in the ass. Yeah, don't Ooh. swear at the guy. Just... Talk about people. Pause. <laughs> Pause. A car or a girlfriend. Jesus. I should have blown <laughs> his head off when I had the chance. <laughs> I want you to turn around and go outside and come back. He like, he getting tired of this boy. See how you gonna see it now. I need a haircut if you ain't too busy. The old Italian son of a bitch prick barber. <laughs> Does my ass hurt from all the guys in my construction job? <laughs> <laughs> God, look at look how Walt looked at him. <laughs> he like he couldn't even get mad at him that time. He like that was a good one there. Oh yeah, see that construct that one I'm saying it'd be hot out there, man. It'd be hot out there. My head gets get cracked. And a goddamn prick to the shop wants to bend me over for 2100 Oh, please. <laughs> oh, man. What the world? Who the hell's everybody want my car? Well, I'm not surprised. Yeah, you don't know the half of it. All right, come on, Zipper. <laughs> he said you don't know the half of it. Stay here and play with himself. He <laughs> <laughs> said they let him stay there and play with himself.
Boy, that's why I be saying, man, that construction. Woof. There you go. Not to bitch, but when I be needing some tools. Tools I've got, but I'm not gonna lend you. <clears throat> why he are we going down these creepy al uh, alleyways, bro? Oh God, you got to be kidding me! It's so crazy that he always find his way going down these these creepy, stupid alleyways all the time. You can't just leave me alone. What? Hey, check this out. You scared, huh? They always messing with him, man. Why the fuck you gotta make me look bad, huh? Yo, keep your hands off my stuff. Smash this, my job, man. Why are he hitting them for? That's my stuff. Don't Yo, come on, smoke, fence. man. Fuck it. <laughs> Let me go. <laughs> Let me hey, little go. Bitch. That don't make no sense right there. And that's supposed to be his little cousin. I'll, I'll replace him. Don't worry about the tools. I just hate he always find a way. Oh, he's gonna go find him. He watching him now, boy. Boy, they done pissed him off now. They done pissed him off now. How do you want your dog? I mean, the. Uh... <laughs> he said, how do you want your dog? Well, I'm feeling good. You know, I got beautiful women, great food. And Tao? <laughs> and even Tao isn't bugging me. He said, we already told you we only eat cats. We don't eat no dogs. <laughs> now I slipped in the shower. No big problem. Uh, look, now Yum Yum. If he doesn't... He said, Yum Yum. Yeah, I'd let you take the Grand Torino. Really? Yeah, really. Oh, God. But see, that's the thing, though. If he get it there, they ain't gonna do them but try to take it from him. That's the thing. Oh, God, here they go. Golly. Get on the phone and call right now. Golly. That's why he say, man, them dudes, they I ain't like them from the get-go, bro. Man. They gotta try to call the ambulance or something. Why they ain't call the ambulance or the police? How is gonna be a shooting with no police and ambulance? Oh my God. Oh my God, they jumped on her. That straight just now jumped on her. Why they ain't calling the police or the ambulance or nothing, bro? This is ridiculous. They gotta, they gotta get something dead to them, bro. But this is just ridiculous. It just got out of hand now. Oh, man. Oh, my God. They just got ridiculous, bro. Like, they got to get some digits now. Only thing I'm looking at, I'm like, where's the ambulance or the police? It, that was a shooting. One thing about the Hmong, they keep their mouths shut. Yeah, I've noticed that. I ain't seen no police or nothing. That's why I was like, yeah, you know, they gonna call the police or not? Well, he said they did, so okay, we'll just go with that. What should Tao do? I know what I would do if I was you. I'm re I want to hear theirs. What? Go ahead, because I'm ready to hear this one. If I was Tao, I guess I'd want vengeance. Yeah, oh, yeah. I want to stand shoulder to shoulder with you and kill those guys. Here we go. They're gonna have to do something to him, though. Oh, so he gonna have to do something to him because they ain't gonna go away. They just gonna keep on. I don't wanna sit. I said sit down. 
But I understand how he feel, though, man, because... Cousin of yours and the rest of those zips? Mr. Tough Guy out for blood all of a sudden? You know nothing about it. See, the thing is, Walt probably trying to get it for where they all somewhere together instead of because you just get one of them, you still got the other three or four that's still away. So you want to get them all together. I see what Walt probably trying to say. Yeah. Here, here's a 20. Keep the change. It's just in case you hit my juggler. <laughs> Golly. What can I do for you, Mr. Kowalski? I'm here for a confession. Oh, Lord Jesus, what have you done? Nothing. Oh, <laughs> you like, oh, Lord. It's Betty Jablonski at the factory Christmas party. Mm. Dorothy was in the other room with the other wives. Boy, he had thought, father had already thought Walt did something. He's like, oh, God, what you done did? What you done did? He said, he ain't did nothing yet, but it's coming. Cause he definitely gonna have to take them out because there's no way that they something and shot up them, them people house trying to kill their own people. It's just ridiculous. Oh, I am at peace. Jesus Christ. He already know. Father already know what, what Walt's finna do. He gonna have to, bro. Cause yeah, that's foolish. That's the exact reaction they're waiting for. Go ahead and close this up. Yeah, well, he's trying to he trying to get a direct hit on him, bro. What are you doing? Huh? Relax. You can't get out of there. You let me out right now. Let me Oh, he didn't want to go. He didn't want him to go. Take me with you right now. Let me out. Look, you've come a long way. He don't want him to hurt himself though. He don't want him to get killed. Walt! 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 And then he just locked him up in there and he can't even get out. I kind of get it though. Like he don't want Tal to go because he don't want him to end up getting shot or nothing like that. And I can understand that, but shoot, Tal wanted, he wants some get back. They, they, they messed her up bad too. You want to smoke as you found me? Nah, she didn't let him out. Todd's got not one second for you. Says who? Yeah. Oh, man. A light? The fuck? Well, everybody coming outside. Hail Mary for grace. Well, they ready to pull that gun. Oh man, they shot him. Man, man. Oh man, this is sad, man. Ain't that sad, man. I hate he tried to pull a gun out though, and they they already had guns pulled on him. I hate he did. I hate he did that. So he really let them. He they basically killed him. So now they all gonna go to jail. That way they can they can live free and won't have to worry about them no more. But I man, I hated it. It was like that. Man. Well, he basically died trying to take off for their family. And I want to leave my house to the church because Dorothy. Man, that is sad, man. That's a sad, sad situation, though, that he, he lost his life trying to take off for them. From doing any of that, it's yours. So he kept the car and the dog. And your skin. Man. Just wondering. Gentle mouth. Read them produced by Clint Eastwood. My Grand Torino. Things I know. All right, y'all. What a great movie. Like I said, I don't like the way it ended, man. I understand he was, you know, he uh, started taking up uh, for the neighbors. And then, you know, doing it cost him his life. You know, but uh, like 
You know, like, I just hate at the end that he, you know, tried to pull out a gun when they already had about seven or eight guns drew on him. So I don't know if that was his way of saying, okay, I'm already dying or something like that. So I'm going to let them shoot me or whatever the case may be, kill me. That way they can go to jail and now Totem can live way more better and don't have to worry about these guys no more. So, but like I said, it's a very, very good, uh, very, very good movie. Uh, thank you to everybody that wanted me to check this movie out. Like I said, it was good from beginning to the end. Like I said, very sad though, you know, but absolutely loved it. Like I said before, the original, like this, uh, my whole reaction to this will be posted on Patreon. Uh, like I mentioned before at the beginning of the video. So y'all make sure y'all follow us on Patreon so you can see the full movie reaction to this right here, all right? And uh, like I said, thank you all for watching, and i catch y'all in my next one.